everyone. Welcome back to a new episode of Anucard. Last time we left off, we completed another dungeon, and we'll probably have to have a shorter episode today. I'm back to four LPs going at once, so we'll probably be back to 30-minute episodes for this. But, uh, that's fine. It's not the biggest deal. Um, but let's see what we got going on. So what exactly was I doing? I think I'm supposed to go back to Kunlun Village and do something, but I do need to eat. So we've never made, um... This is the MSG that I got. Mad Suction Grenade. Uh, sure. Do that. Uh, good job. Now we be cooking? Yeah. Did it done. Okay, I got some MSG. We got french fries. Ah, oh, don't leave anything on the plate or I'll throw you under my cauldron. Food smells so good. Yeah. Taste of the cream improves your self-esteem. Wow, uh, that was a big increase to my HP. Wow. Okay, MSG is pretty good. Um... So yeah, I think we had a side quest with, uh, Babuchan, wasn't it? That we needed to do? Uh, here we go. Uh, new city, new beginning. Our new friend, President Mamajaya from Kunlun City, is giving us all a warm welcome. Wheel Estate and Bosonus, uh, Bosonus opportunities are being discussed. I don't think that's what's happening. Uh, Greenloon, uh, greetings from Kunlun City. Join our executive Kunlun City tour to explore every landmark and admire the sophisticated blend of culture and modernity. Everyone's invited. Okay. We should head over there and do that. Did I do... Yeah, I did all of this stuff last time. I remember. Alright, cool. So, let's get on over there, why don't we? Uh, teleport to Kunlun. So yeah, we might have to stop this time before we actually do a dungeon. Hopefully we get enough video without, uh, fully doing a dungeon. Woohoo, welcome to our beloved Kunlun. <laughs> yeah, okay. Cool, thank you. Alright, I'm ready to start the tour. Crap, what do I do with these orchard villagers? Just help me give a tour, comrade. Sure. Uh-huh. Uh, what am I doing? I let everyone choose their favorite spots. Let's check out where they're going, comrade. Uh, okay. Limba son, what are you doing? For the record, I won't be in this stinking area long. I've been thrown away a lot from here before, but this is an exception. Oh, sir, who? Uh, Sir Babachan, I noticed all the tall buildings, but this particular building is bigger and greater than the others. Right, you immediately noticed it too, chief? This must belong to someone important, like me, for example. <laughs> Who the pile of garp? Sorry. Who are you again, sir? <laughs> I'm chief of the Orchard Town- uh, 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 M City! I'm the one who taught this bell wielder everything. Well, valid, I guess. Okay, this is the residence of Mamajaya, a noble, the president of Kunlun City. Remember her? She is the child of the previous president. It's like a stinking dynasty. Please don't get too close to this house. You see those tiny guards? Commoners aren't welcome to go into or nearby a noble residence. What? But we aren't commoners, are we? In a sense, we are. You are not from a noble family. Yes, you are a commoner. Yet you probably will get different treatment as you're visiting guests from another city. Interesting. So your citizens get classified by some sort of social status and don't mix together? I don't like it myself, but we can't do anything. Some of us just have no privilege to choose our, choose our fates. That sucks. That's deep. Heh <laughs> thank. What a weird system. I don't get it, but as long as I don't get involved... Oh wait, could we call the Lady Prez again to say hi? No, just stink and leave her alone and don't pull a dangerous stunt. Okay, jeez. Alright, so that's where they were hanging out, so we... Finish their tour. Getting a lot of inspiration for the Orchard's next construction project. Project. <laughs> Social status. How complicated. Okay, yeah. So now we go talk to you. Madam, you shouldn't go there. Why? It's the path to our research center and there's a big lab. It's the most sophisticated building in Kunlun City, but it's strictly limited to nobles or science workers. You guys have that? I am a scientist. Could I pass as a visitor? Sorry, it's not for outsiders, but of course the bell wielder could go there. I see. Well, what could a lowly farmer do in there anyway? 
How about you slip me in? Young lady, I may not look it, but I actually stink and work there. I don't need longer, so I don't have the pass either. What a bummer. Bell wielder, please get me a pass. See those workers and guards? They're made to work for us humans. Robots? Like the tinies? How convenient. Oh, you also have tinies? Yep, we sure do. Exciting. We should borrow those guys through the orchard, bell wielder. If your pa were still alive, he would be so happy to see those incredible buildings. His love for science and technology. The city of Kunlun would be so suitable for his kind. Mentor Patty. Who is it again? Never mind. Seems like majority of the places in Kunlun City are restricted. What a bummer. Yet I'm captivated. You know, you know, young lady, you're weird. Young and you don't don't you ever say that to a girl. Is that supposed to be a compliment? Never mind. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you like being called weird. Ramu. Uh alright, so what's going on over here? Oh, are you checking out the uh the uh, sugar cane? All the MSG. Bro, is this place a storage area? It's small compared to bars though. You mean small, small, but it's comfy. Hmm, well, yes, it's small. It's a house, by the way. <laughs> At least I have a house. It's something rather than living with each other in the dumpsters like this guy does. <sighs> oh, you tell everyone about it, don't you? Man, don't get the wrong idea. My house is smaller and I love it small. Y'all have houses as big as storage house? It's also awesome. Well, cr n never mind. This is Sasa. She's a cultivator? Inventor? I found an incredible thing that makes everything taste better. <laughs> now we're talking, I'm a seaweed farmer and I care so much about taste. Especially your mommy, king of flavor. I see you're a man of science, are you? What's your name, boy? I will 1000% remember it. What exactly is the thing? It's MSG, monosodium glutamate. We process sugar canes and the extraction gives a rich flavor to our food. That's my line, mind you, Baba-chan. Can I try it? Hmm. Usually this is a very, very, very rare and luxurious thing to have, but this is a special case. Okay, I'll give you a sip. Take this as a souvenir and take a bite. Tainted ration biscuit? Sounds awful. These are the biscuits that, uh, was talked about in the flashback. You bite and try to grasp the texture of it, but you end up disappointed. You swallow it quickly as you don't want others to notice. What? How? It tastes like... nothing? Now you get the taste of our food. This tastes good, mommy boy. Sprinkle this and try again, darling. The darling seriously? Decided to give it another try. This tastes so much better? Like my seaweed did to our foods. Come again, I'm not sure your thing can surpass my MSG. <laughs> Man, I ain't into competition. There is this magical thing that makes food much better. Just imagine what you could do with the produce at our orchard. Baba-chan, well, why do they have fresh food at the orchard? Yeah, apparently they have a superior environment for farming. Man, y'all must be sick of eating this junk. Uh-uh, thanks for your sympathy, Sir Laza. Gotta try our food. I did, can't forget that taste. I know, right? Our chef is godly, so please come again to eat. Oh, I'll be very delighted, mommy boy. Poor Babuchan. <laughs> Babuchan, tell me why my seduction is not working against him. How should I stink and know, okay? So you are trying to seduce Lhasa. How dare you? Lhasa is too pure. Alright, Bon Bon. Ahem. Mm, avoid garbage talk, Babuchan. Got it? Yeah, your whole thing is you keep talking about garbage because you live in garbage. Oh look, what an interesting structure. What is this building, Sir Babuchan? I mean that Tori? Red gate for the uh stinking shrine. Does that mean your citizens also have a praying place? This place was used for a ritual. Yo, I can't argue, it's an interesting place. But I doubt your people worship properly. Look at those green leaking Yeah, that smells familiar if you get what I mean. 
impressed you noticed. Totally familiar with the spell of Garp. Forget it. You know, this guy always also smells funny, don't you think? Bon Bon, that's disrespectful. Ahem, Sir Bobby Chan, did you mean your citizens also acknowledge the Guardians? Not quite. We worshipped the dungeon itself, back when there were a lot of people there. There was this belief that we all could ascend gracefully from this stinking depressing life in the city. And this place is the path to the dungeon. This place was sacred, but after the majority of us went through the ascension, there was no one here to take care of this place. Crap. D disgusting, I know. Come on, madam, should we move on to the next area? Whoa, whoa, wait, you guys had a praying ritual by entering the dungeon? That's what I was about to ask. My husband almost died in the dungeon. Ah, I get why you're shocked. The dungeon in ours might not be the same, but indeed it is a dangerous place. I had some ways to keep him safe from the monsters, but alas, the technology is no longer working. Kids will be so interested to explore the site. Care to explain more, sir? Right, I need to tend to the other guests. See you soon, madams. Yo, recall, where are the kids? Oh god. <laughs> what happened to them? Where do they go? You little shits. They're worshipping a dungeon? That's insane. Wow, man, this place is crazy. Yo, these buildings are unbelievable. Ramo, have you seen the kids? Time workers, Tiny's workers, amazing. Where are the kids? You seen them? He, president only, dirty people, no entry. Okay, rude. I am perfectly clean, thank you. Oh my, oh no, not again. Hee <laughs> hee. Of course he managed to get out of the hold of these useless tinies. But he opened the laboratory already, according to my plan. Come with me, Bell Wheeler. I don't wanna, actually. I would rather continue trying to do this quest line over here. But I need to find out where in the world the kids went? Kids! Where did you go? I was I was trying to talk to you, and I instead tried to kill you. I apologize. Oh, they probably went to the sewer, right? Is that where you went, you little shits? In here, maybe? Aha! There you are. Kids? <sighs> Watch your language, Babuchan language. Hello, fellow kids. Come to... Uncle Babuchan. Oh boy, way to sound like a creep. Well, okay, that turned out weird. Why are you all here? Aren't you supposed to be under adult supervision? A very interesting place, sir. <laughs> then, no. What? No, I mean, there's nothing to see here. This place is huge. Why is there a huge place like this underground? This, this, this place is very smelly, but I don't mind a little adventure. <laughs> this might be an unhealthy environment to breathe in, though. What do you expect? It's a stinking junkyard. Just piles of trash, smelly garbage. That's it. What are the big gold plates over there? They look like scales. Looks like a scale. That's... I don't know, kids. It's been there since before I was born. I heard a rumor that's for the Indigo and Red Guardian, but no one's ever seen it. So, yeah, it's just a story. I see the Triforce hanging out right there. Oh, that's gonna be a hot headline. The Guardian here in the junkyard? I totally need to write that. So they were here. Not now, I guess. But they're two? Wow. I want to draw them. You don't know what they'd look. Can you remember their statues that we drew on together? Don't bring that up. Uh, it was so traumatic to clean that up. Come on, kids. There are a lot of interesting places out there. Shush, shush. Wait, it looks like a co cocoon bed. What is that? Yeah, I was thinking, it's, it's like sleeping bags, right? Or, I don't know, the carcass of a worm? Uh, the, there's someone who lives here. Uh-huh, you live here? No way, I wasn't originally. Okay, I admit, I live here. I lived with the others as well. This place was crowded, but now this place is technically stinking mine. This place should be fun to camp, don't you think, Yayek? Wheezes? Hey, you shouldn't think this is a good place. Do you think we like this place? What's with your standards? But... Cr cr never mind. Sorry, kids. I, I did mean to scream. You don't want to live or spend even a night here. It's a terrible place for humans. Well, let's get out of here, okay? Yui, did you ask ma'am's permission? Ah, oh, crap. We're gonna be disciplined. Language, kids. Uh, the tour is finished. Let's get back to the Tory Gate at the center of the city. I'll wait for you guys there. 
don't have much more time to babysit you all, you know? God, yeah. You're not good with kids, friend. But yeah, look at the Triforce hanging out right here. Hello, Triforce. Stop, Link. You don't have to go, uh, sailing around all over the place looking for the pieces. The Triforce is right there. It's in the sewer. Alright. So now that we've finished that, we should be good. Getting a lot of inspiration. Wow, man, this place is crazy. Oh, crap. We're gonna be disciplined. Tour guide seems like a nice uncle. We're gonna get in trouble after this. But what? I'm missing someone. Who am I missing? Or do I just talk to you? Are you finished it? Yeah, okay, yeah, that's it. We did get everyone. I kept hearing that noise that, uh, I think Ricola makes, uh, or Cleo when, um, they're, like, making something. So I was like, are they around here doing something? Okay, that's it, fellow Anacardians. Can we stay a little bit longer, please? Okay, this is the last interesting spot. The giant Tori. This giant Tori is the centerpiece of this city. It's ancient. I don't know when it was built. Ooh, Uncle, you're not really helping. You yuck, let people finish talking. But from what I heard, this is for worshipping the guardian that resides in Kunlun City. Guardian of Energy, Indigo, and the Guardian of Wisdom, Red. It must be incredible to have two guardians in your people's presence. Funny fact, they're long gone or never actually resided here. The villagers didn't believe in them at first, but here they are now. Uh-huh. I guess that's valid. This has the same shape as the shrine and the weight of the lab. Any philosophical meaning to adding gates inside a city? Gate means transition. From outside to inside, from mundane to sacred, from dark to bright, from ignorance to enlightenment. Wow, that's deep. Uh-huh. Thanks. No. What, what am I thinking? Yeah, Tori are cool. I really like them. Just walking through the Tori, it's... I don't know, it's, it's always a cool visual thing. If I ever go to Japan, which I would love to someday, I would love to go to a shrine. Ahem. Sorry, lady. Actually, I don't know what I'm talking about. We haven't really worshipped any gods in a very long time. Since the fall, maybe even before it. So this piece here doesn't serve any purpose anymore. But we keep it because it looks cool. That it does. What a waste. It'd be great if we had giant mom units to properly praise the guardians. Hey, we have enough gold to build that. Just don't steal the spotlight from my new gold statue. <laughs> Number send you weirdo. Bro, the air is pretty bad here. What's with the smoky atmosphere? Y'all burning something? We process dungeon essence into energy, turn on lights and run devices, and these are the stinking residual substances. Finland has pretty plenty of cool stuff. Expect expect my visit often. I don't think I like it here. It should be an eye-opening trip for us. Don't get too cynical. It's refreshing to see something different, but being in a pasture with the hens is the best after all. Time's up, everyone. Please bring your stinking dispute somewhere else. From Bell Wielder, here's another souvenir from Kunlun City. Thank you for helping me conduct this tour. A Tori! Oh, that's cute. Souvenir? Hey, I want that too. Side quest completed. Would you look at that? Is there anything new at the, uh, whatchamacallit? No? Okay. Thank you for helping me conduct this tour. Okay. Well, now I should go into the lab, I suppose, since we're supposed to get our new memento for our new dungeon. General Ube, my diligent security guard, how do you feel being revived again? You. I don't know how you managed to revive me, but... What do you want from me? You can't be this naive, General. You locked our only lab and fled inside the dungeon. Even Rawson and that new scientist fled too. What's wrong with you people? No, what is wrong with you? All these experiments, all those sacrifices. It's wicked. I should have destroyed this lab a long time ago. Please be reasonable, General. Oh god. Don't move an inch or I'll activate this bomb. How could you do this to us? The Ascension, the experiment, what are we to you? Yeah, the Ascension was talked about, that's when they enter the dungeon, right? Were you forcing people to go into the dungeon? How could you nobles play with our lives? They submitted willingly, we never ever forced them. Then why don't you ascend yourself? Why did you use us, you witch? Knock it off, General. My parents even became the very first subjects of this program. 
we are in the same boat. Without doing that, we would have perished long ago. Yeah, I don't quite trust you. I just don't trust nobility or the rich, to be honest. We wouldn't be here. What's the point being here now? What difference could it make? We have been cursed since the beginning. Now we're going to explode together soon. Stop! This time is different. We have the bell wielder. We are saved. We don't need to do the ascension anymore. Have you calmed down? What can this tiny person do? I saved your ass! At least you have respect to someone who saved your life, eh? Chill, he has no idea. Oh my, you never heard of the prophecy? The bell wielders are our hope. With the bell in their hand, they will revive the curse, reawaken the lost guardians, and restore our heaven. To put it simply, everything will become good again. No more ascension? No more tiny's experiment? Oh my, yes of course. Do you understand now? Please dispose of the bomb. No time to be soft, General. Please reactivate the lab, we have to find something important. Tiny's experiments. What does that mean? I don't think it's been explained to me yet, but I might just be slipping my mind. Were you putting people into Tiny's to make them more effective? A lot of the statue had broken away. I've heard that a scientist discovered an object that has a link to the Twin Guardians. Professor Rawson? No, the new guy, the scavenger he called himself. He researched Guardians in secret. I believe he hid something in here before he went to the dungeon. Let's split up and search the area. Okay, searching. Collection of books and papers. You can understand his numbers and formulas. Okay, doing that does nothing. Crisis averted, no fights. Boy with a disfigured head. Okay. Computer? Rebooting. Do not turn off computer. Okay. How long has that stupid thing been rebooting? This looks like one of the switches that are in the dungeon. So many broken statues. Tubes filled with mysterious liquid and pieces of stones. Yeah, that looks like the uh, soul things that we keep getting out of the dungeon, right? You're unable to peek at what's stored inside. Well, I see what I need to pick up over there. I apologize for the fuss. You shouldn't see all that. Okay. This thing looks precious. Can you smell something off it? Hey, am I your dog? Oh my, you found something? Sure did. I think that belongs to Rosin. How are you so sure? Oh my, well it's a slight change of plans. We'll try to revive Professor Rosin now. Rosin statue, don't worry, we'll find it. Please go inside the dungeon and retrieve Professor Rosin's soul for us. Okay, well we got our new objective. I obviously don't want to go in the dungeon yet. I don't think there's anything else for me to do though, right? Not side quest wise or anything like that. I think we're pretty much good. So I think I'm just gonna go back to my house. And we'll have to end this episode off here because, uh, I unfortunately don't have time to do, uh, a whole other dungeon today. So, let's teleport to Orchard Farm. And go in here. You can see our new stuff that we got. There's my Tori. We don't put the weird food in here. But everything else, though. Slinky toys bouncing on, uh, in the cabinet. It reminds you of a tool. A lion doll, and you look at the miniature Tory gate. Souvenir from the Kunlun City Tourism Department. And there's my succulent. Librarian Chief Limson's office. Do not enter without an appointment. And do not bring animals without permission. There's so much stuff to examine. It's kind of impressive. Alright, so yeah, this will be a sh uh, pretty short episode of uh, Anucard today, but... It's fine. We've had a lot of long episodes, so having a short one's not the biggest deal, so... I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Anacard, and I'll see you next time for some more. Bye.